Hi, it's Brendan Payne with Century 21, the Harrelson Group here along the Grand Strand. And I've been serving the Grand Strand real estate market here since 2007 and have been one of the top producing agents here in our market. I wanted to talk with you today about a couple of things that are important in terms of getting your home sold once we take the listing. Now, we know there's three main areas that we're going to go after in order to attract buyers to come into your property to ultimately get the best offer for you. The first area is what most consumers are traditionally thinking about when we're talking about marketing properties. So when we go ahead and put your property on the MLS, of course, we are trying to attract people that are looking from out of the area and here locally. We know that 90% of the buyers that are searching for property today start their search on the internet. So it's important to not only create a great story for what your property offers them, but also to help differentiate it versus the other competition that's out there. A couple of the ways that we do that are through professional photography, videography. Every single one of our properties gets its own single property website, and we also do a virtual tour. So when someone's sitting five, 800 miles away, then they can actually get a picture of the experience that they're gonna have by living here on the Grand Strand and possibly purchasing your home. The second group of people that we're gonna go after in terms of attracting buyers to your home are those that we already have in our database. So right now we've got about 100,000 buyers in our database. Now, obviously there's not 100,000 people that are ready to write a contract today, but we know that those folks have taken the time to search for properties here. They've set up their search criteria and they're looking for us to keep them in the loop on what new properties are out there. So one of the things that we do is we monitor the most active buyers that are on the, uh, on the website and we're able to then identify what types of properties are they searching for. So when we take a new listing, we can go back and search through previous buyers that have looked for properties just like yours and now market directly to those buyers. The final group of buyers that we're really trying to go after when we're marketing your property are the buyers that are probably going to be working with another agent, maybe outside of our office. Our market's got about 3,500 agents in it right now. And even though the average agent's only selling you know, three to five properties a year, the reality is if that agent that's selling three to five properties a year is selling two or three of those in your neighborhood, then I wanna be able to put your home in front of them. So we do research to figure out who are the agents that are bringing buyers for similar properties to yours in the area and then market your property directly to those so that they don't have to go into the MLS and search through all of the different properties and try to find the perfect one for their buyer. If I can go and put your property in front of them, then we've got a better chance of getting the right buyer in. And we know that the right buyer is typically the one that's gonna pay the highest price. So now that we've gotten this first initial stage of getting the property on the market and starting our marketing process, there's three critical components to what we're gonna provide you in order to make sure that you've got the best experience in selling. Number one is feedback. And we know that the number one thing that's important to our clients is feedback from the showings that they've had or feedback on changes that are happening in the market. So I have a client service coordinator who spends time purely going through and finding out what are the buyers saying about your property, trying to figure out what roadblocks are keeping them from making offers or what they're finding about other properties that seems more attractive and keeping them from choosing yours to put an offer on. We're gonna communicate that feedback to you, not only through the emails uh, and feedback that we get directly from the agents, but also through phone calls and updates um, every couple of weeks. We'll keep you informed on new properties that come in the market that may be competition for you, and also ones that go under contract while worth trying to sell. Next is gonna be follow-up. So, on a monthly basis, we're gonna be reevaluating your property as if we were just starting to list it. So that means going back through and finding out what new inventories hit the market. Who are you competing with? Are there other properties that have sold that maybe will give us some insight into what the buyers are looking for and we'll also follow up with you and make any suggestions on changes that need to be made in order to be able to present a better product to the buyers that are looking. The last area is communication. 
We know that communication is very important to our clients and we're committed to making sure that you know any changes that could be made to help put you in a better position and get an offer for your property. We know communication is critical not only with you but also within our team. My team's committed to daily prospecting to search for buyers for our properties. So each day, if you come into our office, you'll see we're on the phones trying to put buyers and sellers together. Communicating what do we have in terms of a need for a buyer and what listings do we have that we need to find buyers for. That makes the difference in getting you the most showings in the quickest period of time and resulting in the highest offer. The most critical part of selling properties in this market is being able to identify the right type of buyer and attract them to your property. Communicate to you as a seller of exactly what's going on and anything that changes while we're on the market. As your agent, I bring hard work, an aggressive marketing plan, and a commitment to you having a great real estate experience. Thanks so much for watching this. If I can help you with anything in the real estate world in the future, please let me know. Thanks so much.